Hey guys, V here from Jimmy's. I'm here with our boy Kieran today, um, MMA superstar. So we're just going to get a little bit of advice and see what he's about to help you guys maybe who's getting into the sport, um, help you with your nutrition and training and things like that. So I'll just get him to introduce himself and then we'll rock from there. Hey, my name is uh, Kieran Joplin. I fight at the Strike Force Canterbury. I'm the, uh, the Shuriken the NZ champ and also the WKBF Oceania Lightweight champ. Oh yeah, so basically today what we'd like to know is a few simple questions which our, our team would like to know is how did you actually get into it? Uh, we got into MMA maybe five years ago, um, through fan, I had family that was promoting the show, promoting the show and um, went and watched it and fell in love with it and been training ever since. Sweet. Um, and so five years ago, so you've been doing it for about five years now? Yeah, fighting for, oh, training for five years, yeah. fighting, fighting for three. Yeah, sweet. And when was your first fight? Uh, first fight was December 5th, 2009. Wow, that's awesome. Five, yeah. Awesome. And how did that feel, man? Uh, it was, yeah, it was cool to get that first one. Pretty nerve-wracking, good experience. Uh, yeah, it's good. Yeah. Yeah. So what is your sort of overall goal being in the sport now? Well, when I started out, it was just to have that first fight, and then it was to, to win a title. Now it's to, yeah, to crack the UFC, make it big. Awesome. Yeah, we're all big UFC fans out there. Um, in terms of your sort of, so you're training towards a fight on Saturday, right? Yep. Um, so what, is that a title defense? or yeah, defending my uh, Shuriken New Zealand title yeah. in Auckland this weekend. Awesome. So what sort of training have you done to prepare for that? I've had a pretty much a 10 week camp and that's uh, six days on, one day off, training twice a day, like three times a week, Monday to Friday I'll do a strip, finishing in the morning, train every night, do pads in the morning as well, so it's been a, been a big camp. Yeah, so that's big, and in terms of that, you still work, don't you? So yeah, yeah, you're still, still a family man, you're still working, yeah. you're still achieving these goals, yeah. doing what's required. Yeah. Um, and for the boys out there and girls who want to get into it, yeah. what would you say in terms of, say, nutrition, what is the sort of a base that you would follow? I personally reckon that you need to it needs to be the lifestyle. You need to be eating clean before you even start training. Eat clean. Um, you need the good supplements as well. Look after your joints, recovery, and all that. So yeah, it's a lifestyle. Eh? You've got to yeah. live the lifestyle. Yeah. What um, sort of supplements are you using? Uh, me, I take uh, take like standard way during camp. When I'm cutting, I'll switch over to the VG. Uh, so that's like the the new zest. Yeah, take that that P protein. Yeah, the new zest uh, clean lean protein. When and I'm, when I'm building up, I'll I'll take some creatine. Yeah. Take the beta alanine all the way through. Uh, so I'll take some super greens as well. Alkalize the body. Uh, tie in aminos too. Uh, I like the holy grail keeping you going. Yeah. So someone obviously, if you know you're quite an elite, you still you know you believe that as well as good nutrition, good supplementation has also helped you take you to this level. Yeah, for sure. Um, I was just burn out without the extra, without the protein and the aminos, especially. I just uh, won't recover for the next session. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Um, yeah, that's basically all today. Um, thanks for your time, man. And basically, what we're going to do is we're going to get a. Hopefully a little bit of yeah, when you kick ass on Saturday and retain yeah. that title, um, we'll get another interview going and then yeah, we'll Sweet. talk about a few more stuff. At the moment, Sam Gascoigne's just spiking him at the, just putting the pressure on him. Kieran's looking for an arm bar at the moment, Sam, Sam's noticed this but he just needs to get that elbow out. He needs to get that elbow out, he's going for it again. Sam's, Sam's just managed to get it out. All of that rolling and all of the MMA has obviously paid off. He's like, Kieran's going to look for a triangle here if you can get it. If, you get, if he locks it in, you're going to have a triangle. Sam, Sam's in a bit of, he's just pushing it. He's hoping that he can't, put, can't pull it off. But it looked like it's sideways. He tapped, he tapped. Kieran Joplin just won the lightweight title from a triangle. Oh my word. You saw it happening there. But... At the end of the day, he managed to pull it off. It was too tight for Sam to get out. Unlucky for Sam. But well done to Kieran Jordan. He's going to be happy to take that title back from the Strike Force. I can tell you that much.